I've mentioned the Irish element to the music uh, of chamber music that we've written. Um, there's not a great deal of it there, I guess, so far, but this was certainly one of the songs in which we tried to approximate at least some aspect of um, this particular tradition. Um, people may be familiar with the song, uh, She Moves Through the Fair, uh, which is a very famous um, a kind of ballad song, which has been um, sung in many different ways uh, by very many different people um, over, over an extended period of time. Well, this was certainly one of the songs which uh, we had in mind when we were composing the melody for this. Um, it's got no particular time signature because it would be very difficult to sing with um, a, a time signature in mind. We really just uh, play the chords and uh, let the, the vocalist um, sing the melody as she feels um, um, she wants to at, at, during that particular uh, performance. Um, again, we, we um, modulate between a kind of A minor and an A major because the melody certainly goes to that at a certain point before moving to the B minor, but then it moves back towards the um, territory of A minor and then resolves itself in this kind of um, un unresolved chord, as it were, because it hasn't got a third it's just utilizing the, um, the, the, the tonic and the dominant note, the A, I'm sorry, in this case, the B and the F sharp. Um, and this makes for a kind of uh, eerie, um, ethereal, ghost-like um, uh, a song, which we think works particularly well at this point in the suite when things are starting to get a little bit interesting. <laughs> 